Hey guys, it's DJ Fap up here um, with another FTB tutorial, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an automatic apiary system. So what we're going to need is an apiary, a uh, apiary pipe, a A gate. It's not really called an A gate; it's called an auto something gate. Then a chest, a stone pipe, and a wood pipe. What we're going to do is we're going to place our apiary. Then right next to that, we're going to place the uh, wood pipe. Then a stone pipe. Then our APRS pipe. Then on top of the APRS pipe, we're going to place a chest. So what this is going to do is it's going to suck from the uh, apiary and take that and then sort it. And then we'll have items to the top chest and the bees back into the apiary. So to us make it suck, we're going to need to uh, put our gate right there. Then it's going to, when there are items in the APRS that it can take, it's going to pulse. What this means is it's redstone on, redstone off. Then um, we're going to configure. Oh, poop. we're going we're going to configure our uh, apiary pipe. So we want the bees to go back into the apiary and the um, items into the chest. So um, that's our system. Then over here you can see a. Um, our bees. We have the bees and a nova frame. What the nova frame does is when it, if it becomes night time, it will kill these right away. So we're going to do slash time night oh. set night and you're going to be able to see that the bees move through here. Since the bees share the same genes, they will all go back here. But say the um, some bees didn't share the same genes as others, those bees would go up here. So uh, that's our automatic apiary system. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this was useful. So have fun on FTB.